Hello, today I'm going to show you how to fix a texture error on certain faces and I'm going to show you how to fix it. Um, the error that I'm talking about is... Uh, let's find a player that has this error. Okay, so here on the nose you can see there's a vertical line. As you can see on the nose, and uh, it actually catches light as well, so it looks particularly bad. I want to show you how to fix this. So first thing, you need to find the ID of the player you want. And I'm going to do this on Pezmaster. Should be this player here. Nope. Okay, so some of the players are uh, harder to find. I'll show you how we find those anyway. So as you can see his name is Carlos Alonso Rodriguez and he plays for Cruz Azul. So we'll just find him here. Okay, here he is. So this is his ID. You need to have the face and hair modifier for PES 2020 or PES 2021 installed. And you need to have the original face where you got it from uh, also ready. So here's the installation file for this player. As you can see it's here. But what you actually need is uh, this directory here. So you can load up the face in Blender. So once you go to Blender you go to this. Export. Paste the directory and open the face fpk file. Now you import everything. If you zoom in, you can see this line on the model. So this is the line you need to get rid of. So what we need to do is face, go to the mesh, and select it. As you can see, it's selected with the yellow outline. Edit mode. Right click along the line. And then hold control and right click on the nose. Now you just want to press smooth vertex, so tools. Mesh tools, smooth vertex, and just press it until it stops making changes. So after you've done that, just deselect it, and there will be a small error here on the nose still. And you can go ahead and get rid, of, try to get rid of that if you want. But this is good enough for me. So I'm going to export. I'm just going to create this, uh, the FPK files. Okay, once this is done, clear. Now if you go into the game, it's going to give this error. I'm not sure why it causes this. Sometimes it does this, sometimes it doesn't. But to fix this, you basically need to go back to the original installation. And uh, overwrite it with the original textures of the converted face. So this is from a custom face pack that I've got. So you can't get this freely. But this method should work for any player. So again, we need to find his ID. 130256. It's here. And just overwrite all the texture files. This is the installation directory of the face. Let's close this. And then extract these textures, hit yes to overwrite, and this should fix it. As you can see, the vertical line on his nose is no longer there. There's still a tiny, tiny bit that you can see, but it's much, much uh, better. So, yeah, thanks for watching.